Drew DeLuca with us here, Pittston area. Uh, let's talk about uh, the consistency right now for you. Are you hitting the ball? Uh, early on in the year, I wasn't doing my best, but it's definitely gotten better, and you just got to keep your confidence. That's key. Talk about the the game of baseball and uh, you know your sports sports family, and uh, let's talk about the game of baseball. What you love about it? Uh, you know, the competition. Basically, I mean, ever since we were young in little league, we were all competing against each other in the bigger games, and now we form together and can compete against the other big schools. And you know, hopefully, we could make a run district championship. There were some talented kids on this team from that, the, some of those Little League teams, but now you got some other younger players stepping up. So uh, talk about some of the younger talent on the squad. Right, we definitely have a lot of, we have a young core, great guys. Uh, Elijah Barr on the mound, he's become our ace. He's throwing hard for a freshman. The biggest thing with him is he shows no emotion. He could get hit around, he could strike the side out on nine pitches. There's no emotion from him, he's great. And as far as, uh, you know, rallying around uh, one of your guys uh, with an injury, talk a little bit about, you know, what, that, what that's been like for you guys. That's not easy, you know, a veteran player and somebody that, you, you know, you say, hey, this guy, this guy you know, helps uh, the heartbeat of the team. Uh, you Sylvia. know, I think he definitely, definitely took a toll on us, especially coach. That's his guy, Silvio. And, you know, it upset him a little, obviously. But... Uh, you got to move past and other guys could step up and do the job. And that's what we're learning. You got to win without them. You don't have them. So now you got to win without them. Let's talk about the, the, the bats this year, you know, as far as you guys long ball or just get base hits, like what kind of, what kind of squad is fits the area? Uh, everybody could hit throughout the order one through nine. Other, some guys power, other guys contact, other guys just getting on base, whether it's an error or a walk, anything. The, the biggest key is just being on base and having your guys behind you score you. As far as being home and playing, do you feel like your field is an advantage over some of the other places playing at grass? or? Uh, definitely. You definitely have your your fields that you like to play at and home is definitely one of them for a lot of us, I know. Uh, they do a great job with the turf. I mean, it's beautiful, but something that goes uh, unnoticed is the grass in the outfield because I'm there every day and that's spectacular. And uh, let's talk a little bit about the future. It's your junior year. Are you thinking right now of you know, a major, if you want to play baseball at the next level, any of those things right now? Uh, I'm not going to lie. I really have no idea. I'd like to play baseball if I could, but, yeah, hopefully. And uh, let's talk about the district. I mean, there's good competition. You know of it in Lackawanna League and the Wyoming Valley Conference, but you can never look ahead, but just to know that, you know, you guys are probably as good as anybody, but there's going to be some good competition and likely a team from District 2 and we could say 6A or 5A or 4A might be able to make a little bit of a run, but again, we just don't know who that's going to be. Yeah, definitely. There's a lot of great teams in our district. I mean, tons of great pitchers, Division One pitchers, so you got to beat those guys if you want to be the big top guys. So that's what we're planning on doing, and hopefully it works out. How about uh, your uh, sense about the, the pride in, in Pittston with the, the athletic programs? Obviously, academics are so important. We all know that, but... You know, you guys do carry a special, you know, a special following there at Pittston area. Right. There's definitely a certain kind of pride at Pittston area with sports. I mean, the girls have been, they took over last year, two years ago, and now we got a little jealous of that and we want some of our own recognition. And yeah, there's definitely a lot of support around the sports teams and great athletes all around. All right. Well, we appreciate your time and uh, continued success. Thank you very much.